victory. In John chapter 2 verse 4, the Bible says what? And when Jesus went to the wedding in Canaan, the Bible says, and his mother, you know when you know that somebody is anointed, you have an anointed son, and you know that this son of yours is not an ordinary son, you you can boast. The Bible says, and when the wine was, when the wine run out in the wedding feast, the Bible says, and the mother of Jesus, he went to his disciples, he told them, he says, he says, go to him, whatsoever he shall tell you, you shall do it. What did Jesus respond in verse 4? John chapter 2 verse 4 the Bible says Jesus told the mother it says my time has not yet come so even Jesus being God in the flesh he understood what is called prophetic timing there are a lot of people God has called you to ministry God has called you to travel God has called you that you will open a big business but because you don't understand what is called prophetic timing I met a man is in Nigeria and I began to speak to him I said hey, you started this thing so early it was not the time for this thing to be established we went through a lot of struggles when you miss prophetic timing you get into trouble when you miss prophetic prophetic timing you experience delay when you miss prophetic timing you experience frustration there are a lot of people the timing and the, the will that god has ordained for you it is not your time that is why everything you seem to do is frustrating the bible says in ecclesiastes chapter 3 the bible says there is a time for everything there is a time to die and there is a time to be born there is a time to be, to plant and there is a time to reap the bible tells us there is a time for war and there is a time for peace you must understand there is a timing for your call over your life don't let me tell you something let nobody deceive you no matter how progressive no matter how blessed people might be, they can't, they can't subtract what God has given to you. They can't subtract who you will become. Do you know how many people were blessed before Solomon came? A lot of people were blessed. But the Bible says in his time, God gave him wealth that surpassed everybody that had existed before him. Even till today, there is nobody who has been rich like Solomon. Nobody. You have people that say they have billions, billions, billions. There is no body that their wealth can be calculated in the measure of Solomon. Solomon was using gold as nothing. Read, them, read Solomon, you understand. The gold that you see as treasure, you see as a way to preserve your money. Somebody was using it to, to work on it. Work on it. Why? The timing. Each time you fall into the prophetic timing of God's call upon your life, you begin to see helpers will begin to come. You begin to see strange people begin to do things.